So Spirit Airlines just put a six-year-old boy who was flying alone on the wrong plane. A couple days ago, a woman named Maria Ramos bought a Spirit plane ticket for her six-year-old grandson, Casper, to fly him out to Fort Myers to come visit her for the holidays. She had paid an extra $150 for Casper to fly alone, which meant that he would have Spirit employees assisting him along his journey to make sure he wouldn't get lost. But little did Maria know, these employees would actually be the ones to lose him. Even after Casper's mom literally checked him into the right flight, a Spirit employee somehow accidentally put him on a different flight to Orlando instead. So when the plane Casper was supposed to be on landed in Fort Myers without him, Maria, who was waiting for him, had a panic attack. None of the employees she talked to had any idea where Casper was. It wasn't until Casper himself used his phone to FaceTime her from Orlando that she finally realized where he was. Maria ended up having to drive four entire hours to pick him up. Even then, Spirit Airlines still had the audacity to soon release a statement, saying that they took immediate steps to reconnect the boy with his family. Maria responded to this with, why are you lying? Although Spirit has since offered to reimburse Maria for her long drive, she says that she just wants Spirit to take accountability 